<laughs> let's just get into why we are here babes it's gonna be really really quick short and sweet i actually just wanted to um introduce you guys to a few bundles a few packs of hair that i just recently purchased from my local beauty supply store i purchased three bundles and a Bronto this time, you guys. You know that I am the closure queen. All I ever rock, all I ever wear, any wig that I have ever made has been with a closure, so you guys. So today, I have finally purchased me a lace front, you guys. And it's because I'm really, really trying to get a specific type of hairstyle. A hairstyle that I have been wanting and dying to try for the longest. Which pertains to some bangs, which I could have did bangs with the closure. But I got a frontal because, of course, I want the the bangs to come like down to here I want a fringe bang and then I kind of want like the sides pulled up you know either braided up or just up in, in specific you guys in a ponytail and then kind of like the bun bun and then just let the hair hang in the back I was gonna cut it the hair in the back to neck length to do a bob but I actually have a 16 a 14 and an 18 and I'm not sure if I want to cut it yet or not so I guess I'll have to wait until after I make the wig and fit it onto my head and all that good stuff to see which way I really want to go to make up my freaking mind. I also picked up some conditioner just because I was in desperate need of some. So I just picked up some cream of nature coconut milk detangling and conditioning conditioner. I just picked up some of this you guys for my natural real hair or whatever so yeah this is just another one of the beauty products that i have just recently purchased from the hair store you guys so let's just go ahead and head right over here you guys to my bed so we can get into these bundles bitches okay <laughs> and of course as always i'm just sipping on some of my lipton lemon and ginseng and tea. i added a lemon in there yes yeah, i'm almost gone but i have like a whole nother yeah, a whole nother round of it brewing up. So I'm about to go in the kitchen and refill my cup. But in the meantime, in between time, honey, let's get into these fun do bitches. Oh, <laughs> I have just refilled my cup with more tea. And by the way, you guys, I am so in love with my new iPhone 11. It is amazing, balls. Anyway. Here are the bundles that I just recently purchased from my local beauty supply store. Okay, you guys. So, as you can see, I have three bundles. I kind of got like a deal. I got it in a bundle deal. These bundles were not what they say on the package. Like this one says $34.99. This one says $39.99. This one says $49.99. And this one says $59.99. Really was only like $150 altogether, which I thought was really, really cool. Again, these are the I'm waiting for my camera to focus. These are uh silver brazilian body wave and they come in a natural color and so yeah and as you can see i got them from my local beauty supply store which is called store this right here beauty. you guys is a 14 inch this one is a 16 inch and this one is a 18 inch and then i have a 12 inch lace frontal i was about to say closure because i'm so used to purchasing closures you guys we all know that you have to like sew on your closure or your frontal but to be honest with you, you guys, I'm thinking about just doing like a quick weave with this hairstyle. And because I'm just kind of a lazy bitch right now and I don't feel like sewing on a lot of tracks and a lot of bundles. I'm thinking about just sewing on my uh, lace frontal and then doing a quick weave with my bundles. But I really haven't fully made up my mind yet. And so with that being said, let's just get into a few of the other things that I just recently purchased. And I you guys. also purchased a spandex stocking cap. Now this is not the original uh, spandex spandex stocking cap that I usually purchase it's a different one as you can see it just has like a thinner band on it I feel like the other headband has that thick band on it and sometimes that shit just like irritates my ears like right behind my ears I just wanted to try something different and so I did I purchased this one instead and so yeah I also picked up my favorite powders to use are the uh, BW 
you two clear all professionals i picked up two of these you guys of course so i can bleach the knots on my front i already have a 30 developer volume in my hair closet so we're just going to use that and of course i already have a mixing bowl and a uh, this ain't my first rodeo i've did this shit before i do it all the time so it's going to be a breeze bitches or whatever um what else did i purchase and again like i said i already have have black needle and thread you guys so if i want to sew my wig together and just construct it and make it like that just by sewing it i can i'm just really not up to par for all that right now but then again i'm not in a rush to make my wig because i want it to be right so right now i'm just undecisive if i should just sew my bundles and track to make my wig to construct my wig or do i want to just do a quick wig so of course while i was there at the hair store i just went ahead and purchased two bottles of glue just in case i do decide to go ahead and make a quick weave wig yeah i'm still undecisive right now beauty gang family but go ahead and leave me some comments in the comment section you guys letting me know which one do you like best and which one do you prefer do you like to sew on your tracks to construct your wig or do you find it much more quicker easier and convenient to just go ahead and do this shit in a quick weave like i'm thinking so with that about being doing. said you guys i did not i forgot to purchase me some bottles of black rinse which i will be using probably the adore brand i love the adore brand i've used it on all my wigs and all my bundles all the time and so either way you guys i am going to do the watercolor method because right now like i said my hair is in a natural color all my bundles as well as my closure is in the natural color you guys and so yeah we not rocking it like that of at course, all of course i'm going to so. pick up probably just I want to say two bottles of the Jet Black. I believe it's the number 121, but I'm not sure. Um, the Jet Black Adore uh, Rinse. We're going to just use those to do the watercolor method to dye my bundles as well as my closure black. And so, yeah, but I've been thinking about experimenting and doing so, some yeah, other like, shit, you guys. Lie, you guys. I'm not even going to hold you. Like, I really, really, really have been thinking about doing a few other things, like dibbling and dabbling and experimenting with this entire project. I'm not the type of chick or the type of female that's just, like, consistently stuck on just having all black hair or wearing all black hair. I just figure since my bundles are, like, already in a natural color, I just wonder if I use, like, a really really dark purple and do the watercolor method would it turn that color or if i use my emerald hair dye and because one thing i don't want to do is dye my bundles like my mind is so fucking made up about that like i will not i repeat i will not be dying my bundles at all whatsoever you guys because i feel like the bleach and the processing all that crap all those chemicals on the hair just me my personal opinion I feel like that kind of like damages the hair, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I'm thinking about, well, what I know that I'm not going to do for sure, you guys, I will not. I repeat, I will not be dying and processing my bundles with no bleach. That is not an option. You know what I'm saying? I want to keep my hair but dark. I was just wondering that since it's already a natural color, if I try the watercolor method with just like one of my color dyes that I already have, I wonder if it'll come out with just like a hint or a tint of color, if that makes sense. Like, I don't want a bright color wig, but I want it to have just like a hint or a tint to it. I've just been having some extra hair dyes left over, you guys, from when I first started uh, experimenting and making wigs, you know what I'm saying? And so, uh, yeah. I have leftovers, Adore brand, because that's I how have I have the Emerald 168, you guys. This is like damn near a full bottle that I have left over. Then I also have a bottle of 114, which is the Violet Gem, which is a really, really, really pretty purple color. And then I also have, which this is not a whole bottle, it's just kind of like a little leftover in here. I have 164 Electric Lime, and this is from when I uh, experimented and dyed my real hair, you know, like my natural natural hair pink neon pink and uh electric line which was really 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 fucking pretty if you have not seen that or watched that or checked that video out yet my love please make sure thank you do i'm thinking about using these especially the emerald like i think the emerald is so pretty emerald is my fave but i am really thinking about dipping my bundles into some color just to experiment with it you guys and see how it comes out then of course if it doesn't come out so good or if it comes out in a way that i don't really like um i can always go back and dye the shit's jet black you know what i mean like it's never too late to go back and dye it jet black because we know black is the darkest color there is a black 
wax sticks pretty much to any and everything. And so, yeah, that's what I was thinking about, you guys. I don't know, so. babes. I am going to need your honest, 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 this, this, opinion about this because I'm not sure yet as again like I said you guys I'm thinking about just experimenting with it but please leave a comment below if you have any type of suggestions about me doing this or trying this or experimenting with this um if I wanted to like get a really really bright color you guys I would have just bought 613 blonde bundles but of course again these are just a natural like 1B colors so I'm thinking about doing a watercolor method on them so that way my hair is still dark but it has just like a hint of color to it if that makes sense and then i was going to do my frontal this like really really pretty i don't know i'm still color, undecisive so. right now if not these two colors you guys then i probably will be going like right down the street to my local beauty supply store and just purchasing two adore dyes and jet black and just making my entire wig black so i'm undecisive right now you guys i'm really really not sure but i just wanted to come to you loves today with this really really cute quick blog let me sit down because the bitch is tired Ugh. I just wanted to come to you guys today with this really, 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 like, really fucking quick vlog. Just to introduce to you guys and show you guys my new hair, my new bundle that I just recently purchased. Just So I'm just praying and hoping that it comes out really good. Of course, I have to bleach the knots on it, uh, put it on my wig head over there. Yeah. That's just about it. So yeah, you guys, as you can see, I'm just at home relaxing, chilling like a villain or whatever with my feet kicked up, drinking some of my good, 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 good ass hot. I was about to say, what the fuck is that? <laughs> so, uh, let me sit up a Yeah, you guys, bit. as you can see, I am just like currently at home right now, chilling like a motherfucking villain with my feet kicked up. Sucking on some of my favorite cough drops, some recolors, and drinking uh, some of my favorite tea with a nice little lemon in it. I'm just chilling. I'm in relaxed mode right now, but I know eventually I will have to begin the process of my wig or whatever. So don't judge me. Don't roast me in the comments. I know I'm on here right now looking a crazy, crazy makeup list. Not ashy. <laughs> That's one thing I'm not. A bitch ain't ashy oh, I have on so much freaking cocoa butter. All over my face right now, just letting that sink into my skin and absorb. You know what I'm saying? A bitch, you bitches out there, y'all better make sure y'all moisturize. Moisturizing is important, okay? I'm just uh moisturizing my skin, sitting here chilling with my feet kicked up, watching TV, you guys. But I know eventually I have to get on the ball on constructing my wig. And so yeah, I just wanted to introduce you guys to my bundles and whatnot. You know, first, before I actually started making my wig or whatever. And I am thinking about experimenting with these colors, but I'm really not sure. But just being the crazy, daredevilish type of bitch that I am. <laughs> I'm really, 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 really thinking about doing it, you guys. Yeah. I don't know. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't know. I might, I'm guys. thinking about making a separate video because I've, I've never really made one of these videos before. So I'm thinking about making a whole nother separate video, you guys, with me actually constructing and making my wig. I've never did that before. So if you guys are interested in seeing that, if you want to see how I do everything, just please go ahead and drop and leave a comment below. And I will be sure to try to push that out for you guys. So yeah, I think that's just about it for right now, Beauty Gang. Of course, I will come back. I don't know if it will be at the end of this video, at the end of this vlog. Do an update video for you guys so you can see how my overall wig came out. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, that's just about it, Beauty Gang family. And I am not going to hold you. I am not going to keep you guys long at all whatsoever. I just wanted you guys to see my motherfucking bundles that I just spent the arm and a leg for. I just broke the bank and spent a nice little coin for, you know what I'm saying? I just wanted to show them to you guys and introduce, introduce them to you guys really, really quickly. That's just about it. And I will, I guess, come back with the update video for for you guys so you can see the final results and how the wig came out or I'll either just insert some pictures for you guys at the end of this video at the end of this vlog I don't know I guess it just depends on how fast I do the shit or whatever and push out the video and all that good stuff and we all know it takes forever to edit everybody hates editing but it's a part of our YouTube live yeah that's just about it you guys and I will see you all later <laughs> Hmm. <laughs>
Bye, babes. Bye.